Hey, what's going on guys? It's Pew and No5 here, and so I've been getting comments on my latest video on how to play the Visual Boy Advance, like, play the Pokemon games, so, and it, some of you guys have been telling me that you're getting the internal batteries run dry issue, so I'm going to be showing you how to fix that, so here, let me just set this up, um, to turn that off, and so I'll show you guys what it will look like for you, so if I open up Pokemon Ruby, here, then it's going to tell me the internal battery has run dry, the game can be played. It might tell you it can't be played or cannot be played, I can still play it, and it'll tell me clock-based events won't occur, which doesn't matter because this is Ruby, and it's like not an online thing, but you know, still, that's annoying to have, especially if it doesn't even allow you to play the game. So here, I'm going to show you how to fix that, so close this out. You don't have to open up the game or anything, just go, and then go to options, go down three to emulator, then go down to real time clock here, turn that on, and as you can see, that's turned on, then you can just close this out, and then reopen your game, and it should work now. So you just scroll through, see, no problem, so... Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Remember to like and subscribe, and drop down a comment telling me how much you appreciate it. Well, no, don't do that. You don't have to do that, but, you know, just comments help, you know. And so thanks, and I'll see you next time, and have a good day. That's kind of sus.